she has more Tony Performance Awards than any other stage actor. And on Thursday Audra McDonald picked it up one more trinket for her mantelpiece, the National Medal of Arts. The heavily pregnant 46-year-old received the honor, as well as a warm embrace, from the president himself Barack Obama. Despite being billed in the citation as an unforgettable performer, both she and the POTUS had to laugh off the drawn-out silence before her presentation at the White House ceremony when the announcer could not find her citation. She's feeling kinda left out, he smiled as the PA scrambled to find her introduction. I can make up a citation if you want. He even thanked the gathered journalists when one helpfully prompted from the laughing crowd, she's from Fresno. Eventually the script was located to roars of approval, and the former private practice star was helped to the stage, looking fabulous in a fitted black dress. For lighting up Broadway as one of its brightest stars, the apologetic narrator finally announced, as the commander-in-chief held a comforting arm around her shoulder. An unforgettable performer, she has won six Tony Awards. In musicals, concerts, operas, and the recording studio, her rich, soulful voice continues to take her audiences to new heights. The almost mother of two then leaned in to receive her enormous purple ribbon medallion, as well as an even bigger hug from the president. The German-born beauty has won six Tony Awards, and was the first performer to win in all four acting categories. She won Best Performance by a Featured Actress in a Musical in 1994 for Carousel, and again in 1998 for Ragtime, Best Performance by a Featured Actress in a Play for in 1996 for Master Class, and again for A Raisin in the Sun in 2004. Best Performance by a Leading Actress in a Musical for Porgy and Bess in 2012, and Best Performance by a Leading Actress in a Play for Lady Day at Emerson's Bar and Grill in 2014. Audra has one daughter, Zoe, with bassist ex-husband Peter Donovan. She is currently expecting with second husband, stage actor Will Swenson. Other medal recipients on Thursday included Mel Brooks who jokingly kneeled as if he was about to be knighted instead. Write anything you want because we'll never be heard from again. We will all be arrested for this movie, Obama laughed as he recalled the comic director's instructions to his writers on the boundary-pushing film, Blazing Saddles. Morgan Freeman was also honored, but the President Obama lamented he could not be there to collect his award in person. He, is undoubtedly off playing a black president again he joked. He never lets me have my moment. Other honorees included Motown producer Barry Gordy and composer Philip Glass as well as authors Sandra Cisneros, Ron Chernow, Rudolfo Anaya and James McBride. We believe that the arts and the humanities are in many ways reflective of our national soul. They were central to who we are as Americans dreamers and storytellers and innovators and visionaries, Obama said in his introduction. They were what help us make sense of the past, the good and the bad, and how we chart a course for the future. Slash slash. Data adverts dot add to array pus, in red underscore player, type, 636 by 1, id, in red player, slash slash share or comment on this article.